Hey guys, welcome back to Team Foxer. In this episode, we welcome 223's Jason, all the way from New South Wales, Australia. So there's no real need to rush this shot. This fox doesn't look like it's going anywhere. The night sight proving that it's a great tool for recording videos in the daytime as well as at night time. The 55 grain Sierra Blitz King round puts Charlie down, no mistaking. All filmed through the night sight. So, we're now back out with myself. I'd had a call earlier in the week from the gamekeeper to say that a fox had been spotted by a dog walker somewhere near our duck pond, so I thought I'd better get down there and check it out. As I scanned across the field, I looked over and saw what I thought looked like a fox sleeping at the edge of the field and I'm on the 16 times mag now and it's quite a way off so I thought he's not going anywhere I'll see if I could stalk in a little bit closer uh, and uh, take the shot from there and so I did I got into about 115 yards he sat up I steadied my footing and uh, get ready to take the shot just as he lays back down again Sounded like a damn good solid hit to me. Cue the straight tail of doom. So let's take a quick trip down south to see how Joe's been getting on. see Charlie coming in from a long way off, though the ATN has no problem picking out Charlie from distance. A perfectly placed bib shot there from Joe. And just look at how little recoil there is here as he sticks one straight in the bib. Now one of the things I love about shooting at night time is the plethora of wildlife that you get to see while you're out and about. It was the cat's eyes in the background that caught our attention at first. After discovering it was a cat, we thought we'd just stand and observe this handsome fella. Clearly not phased by our presence, he laid back down to rest. On to a different farm now, one last look across the field before we moved on and this pair of eyes were staring back. The almost unmistakable popping sound that you can't quite pick up on video there confirmed to me that it was indeed another headshot. 
the 53 grain round finding its position straight between the eyes. And we're back over to Joe. Now you've got to remember guys this is a pest control mission so professionally taking out the adult fox so that we can also account for the cubs. top job for Joe and a top job for Team Foxer. That rounds off another successful week. Thanks ever so much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos.